Welcome to Fantasy Audiobook, Global God Choice, Only I Choose Saiyan Bloodline 11. Chapter 11, Chapter 11, Jim Martial Arts Showdown, Gravity Training Room. Hearing Shu Hang's cry on the bed, all the other students looked at him. Are you going to the gravity training room? Are you okay? Do you know how much it costs to turn on that thing? I heard from the teacher before that it is said that the cost of opening the gravity training room is in units of 10,000. Moreover, the opening time is measured in minutes. In other words, the cost per minute will exceed 10,000. Listening to the roommate's words, Shu Hang on the bed felt helpless. In a school, all the important resources cost a lot of money. Like a gravity training room. According to the previous teacher's explanation, this gravity training room was built by the National Science Research Center with huge resources in order to meet the cultivation conditions of the super strong. At that time, in order to build this gravity training room, the state took the lead and cooperated with the scientific research departments of major universities. It took three years and countless experiments before it was successfully developed. It is said that at the time of research and development, the electric energy consumed by light every day was as high as 1 million. In addition, material and labor costs are not included. Therefore, if you want to enter the gravity training room that cost a lot of money to build, you need to spend a lot of money or make a huge contribution. Obviously, Xu Heng is not in this list for the time being. Not only the faculty of science, but also the important achievements and resources of other faculties and departments of the university also cost money. The university is generally divided into four colleges, namely the College of Martial Arts and Warfare, the College of Civilization and History, the College of Scientific Research, and the College of Internal Affairs and Logistics. And each college will be divided into different factions, and each faction will have unique research results. For example, in the Academy of Scientific Research, in addition to the gravity training room, there are also high-energy plasma electromagnetic cannons, which will have miraculous effects when facing fierce beasts sieging the city. Published by the Academy of Civilization History, Encyclopedia of Abyssal Beasts. It contains the information of hundreds of abyss beasts, as well as the weaknesses of the major beasts, which has a miraculous effect on explorers outside the city. The Martial Arts War Academy is mainly responsible for training in officers, so this academy contains many ways to stimulate human potential, allowing you to adapt to the inherited power as quickly as possible. Of course, the above materials and equipment have one thing in common. That is, it costs money, a lot of money. Suddenly I feel so poor. Xu Heng sighed silently in his heart, let's go to the ordinary training room first, now I don't need such high-end equipment. So. After having a casual meal, Xu Heng continued to walk towards the training room. Ellipsis 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 dot dot. Come on dumplings, come on dumplings. When he was about to go to the training room, Xu Heng, who was passing by the school gymnasium, was suddenly attracted by the thunderous shouts inside. When I entered the door, I saw a sea of people everywhere, and there were deafening cheers everywhere. In the stadium, there are several different high platforms. On each high platform, there are figures who are learning from each other. Around the high platform, there were students watching the battle, cheering and shouting, which was deafening. Who do you think is better for Chen Dong's dumplings and He Chang's for Keelan? Of course it's Krillin who is under the tutelage of the famous master Master Roshi, so Kamehameha is naturally invincible. I think dumplings are a little cuter and definitely more powerful. Cut, Kamehameha is noticeably stronger. Shu Heng swept his eyes and saw that the battle between Keelan and dumplings was just so so. This level of battle could not catch his eyes. Therefore, Shu Heng soon turned his attention to another area. The crowd was full of people on the high platform. Just looked over. Shu Heng's pupil shrank slightly. Hearing a pop, a broken arm flew high, followed by a smug laughter. Hee hee, my six veins S caliber isn't bad, isn't it, Piccolo Daimao? HMPH, the little trick of the worm, he closed his eyes tightly, and a thick green light emanated from his body. The green light spread to the broken arm, and then, the bleeding section quickly stopped bleeding and grew. After a while, a complete arm reappeared. It's amazing to be able to be reborn from a broken arm. With this ability, it's almost impossible to kill. The big devil is extremely difficult to fit. 
It is absolutely rare, and there are not many fits in the world. Who is this big guy? When did our school have such a god? Come on, big devil, rush rush. Seeing Piccolo, whose broken arm was reborn, exclamations sounded from below. Hearing the cheers around him, Piccolo's morale soared, and he shouted, burst polishing cannon. A huge light burst out from him, hitting the front. Opposite Piccolo, a figure stood with a sword, looking at the dazzling light that was directly directed at him, and smiled slightly. Then he pointed his sword to the sky and said softly, Sword and Thunder Realm, a giant lightsaber condensed by thunder light slowly formed above, and then flashed down fiercely. Bang! With a loud bang, countless thunder lights shot up into the sky, and the dazzling light instantly attracted the attention of the audience. After a long time, the light dissipated. I saw a huge charred ravine running through the entire arena, extending from the foot of the sword to where Piccolo was. Then from Piccolo's left foot, leading to the back. Obviously, the sword bearer showed mercy. After a long time, the audience outside the stadium came back to their senses, and then there was a burst of enthusiastic exclamations in the stadium. Fuck, this is a high-level power technique, from the ruins of the Shenxia world, right? This terrifying power is estimated to be king level. If it weren't for the off-field protective cover, this gymnasium would have to be demolished. Which boss is this, come to Shinshi village to fry fish? This level, it is estimated that it will be difficult for me to reach this level in my life. The students around watching the battle exclaimed in surprise and envy, especially some freshmen, each with a look of longing in their eyes. And Xu Heng, who saw this scene, was also emotionally overwhelmed and couldn't calm down for a long time. However, he is not discouraged. He inherits the Saiyan bloodline and has infinite growth potential. Ellipsis 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 dot dot. My strength is still too weak. Super Psi bloodline, as long as I enter a dying state and recover, I can become stronger, but if my current strength goes up, I might be instantly killed. It's time to start targeted training. Sooner or later, I will crush everything on this martial stage. In Xu Heng's eyes, a firm expression flashed. Global God Choice. Only I choose Saiyan Bloodline 12. Chapter 12. Chapter 12. Brand New Ruins. What an amazing power. On the way back, Xu Heng was still reminiscing about the battle just now. With that terrifying resilience, even a broken arm can be reborn. Although he had seen the full Dragon Ball story long ago, he knew Piccolo Daimao's special abilities. However, seeing the bloody wound with my own eyes, it was restored to its original state in a blink of an eye, and that kind of spiritual impact was much stronger than that on TV. And the terrifying destructive power that almost cut the entire arena in half, even through the energy shield, Xu Heng still felt a deep palpitation. If he faced that sword now, he would have been under the sword long ago, dead. I can't do pure strength training anymore, Xu Heng started planning to do targeted training. He has watched the entire Dragon Ball anime, so he knows very well that although Saiyan has super strong fighting ability, it does not mean that they have no weaknesses at all. The most typical is agility. Saiyan has super strength, and by contrast, agility is one of Saiyan's greatest weaknesses. On the battlefield, when their opponents are faster than Saiyan, they can only stare. Although a burst of aura that is stronger than a burst can be erupted, it is often not timeless and incompetent. In addition, it is attention, or willpower, control. Anger can make Saiyan burst into more power. However, it sometimes makes them lose their minds. The irrational Saiyan, regardless of enemy or foe, attacks at will. Not only will they accidentally hurt their friends, but they may even self-destruct, which is a very serious consequence. So next, we should focus on Saiyan's weaknesses, such as willpower, agility, etc., to strengthen training. Ellipsis 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 dot. All night, on the second day, this was the first official class after graduation. After the class bell rang, the teacher picked up a stack of materials and started the formal class. Students, today is the first day of the official class after the majors are divided, and the classmates may not know each other at all. Next, I will call names one by one to let everyone know each other. No nonsense, 
the teacher picked up the roster and started reading the name. The first one, Wang Qiu, has no hero fit. The second one, Zhang Chao, has no hero fit. The third one, Xu Lang, has no hero fit. The fourth, fifth, the sixth, Yida, has no hero fit. Hearing this, Xu Heng frowned slightly, a little puzzled, did he hear it wrong? Or did the teacher mispronounce it? Six in a row, all of them were people who did not successfully fit the hero. Although I have long heard that the students in the logistics department are less talented, I did not expect this to be the case. Seventh, friend Chang, fits the hero. Hearing this, Xu Heng raised his head and looked at the teacher. Finally have a classmate who successfully fits the hero. Otherwise, this department is too stretched. Fit the hero, Pila. What, can this character also choose to fit? Xu Heng looked weird, and Pilav was considered a character in Dragon Ball. Whole body blue skin, short stature, wearing a small round hat, known as the boss of the dark street. What impressed Xu Heng most about him was when he released Piccolo Daimao. And naively believed that after Piccolo conquered the world, he would be given general territory for him to rule. I don't know what special abilities this character has after successfully fitting in. There's a high probability that they won't have anything. Xu Heng shook his head and smiled. Seemingly unaware of the reaction of the classmates below, the teacher continued to read the roster. The 8th, 9th, the 1st, the 1st, 48th, Xu Heng. Finally, the teacher read Xu Heng's name. Hey, I miss you. Next to Xu Heng, someone patted him. That was his roommate, named Wu Dun, who was huge and fat. Xu Heng still remembers that when he entered the dormitory, he was the first person Wu Dun greeted him, and he was very enthusiastic. Xu Heng, fit hero, Sun Goku. The voice fell, and there were whispers in the class. Fit Sun Goku, is that the liberal arts champion? He actually came to us. It's good to have a fit. How many people don't even have the chance to choose, and they just fail? Different from before, the classmates here heard that he was a suitable character, and no one came to sneer and ridicule, which made Xu Heng a little not used to it. Ha 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 ha. Aside, Xu Heng's roommate, Wu Dun laughed. It's a good fit for Sun Goku. Monkeys like to eat bananas, just the same as mine, hee <laughs> hee. Xu Heng was speechless for a while and ignored him. The last one, Wang Fan, has no blood connection. Just as Wu Dun was laughing, the teacher finished reading the roster, and the students had the most basic understanding. Fellow students, different from the previous time when he read the name, the teacher's tone changed and suddenly became serious and solemn. I know that before you entered the logistics department, you heard countless unbearable words, thinking that this is just a place to eat and wait to die. However, I want to tell you that the logistics department is by no means what you imagined. Our logistics department is not only responsible for the daily material distribution of the school. Like the martial arts department, we also need to be responsible for the exploration of unknown ruins. And, it's different from your impression that you can only fish in troubled waters behind the scenes. Every time we open up wasteland and explore unknown ruins, our logistics department is the first batch of people to enter. The teacher's voice fell, and the students were in an uproar. Why, logistics, isn't it only responsible for internal affairs? How can there be a chance to enter the venue first? Seeing the doubtful expressions of the students below the podium, the teacher smiled slightly. Whether it's fighting beasts, or exploiting wasteland and ruins, the first task is to find out the terrain, find out the number of beasts, and prejudge the danger level of the entire site. All of these require our people to enter the field to implement, so our logistics department is always on the front line of the battlefield. Not only that, after the battle is over and all the dust settles, we also need our logistics department to be responsible for cleaning up the battlefield. So, we were the first to enter and the last to leave. We are the participants in the whole process, we are the most important people. The voice fell, and the students below changed from silence to heated discussion. That's right, who the hell said Lousy was eating and waiting to die, and let him see a few beasts in the future. Those who clean the battlefield are also valuable. Looking at the enthusiastic students below, the teacher looked relieved. Students, I hope you remember that you must have confidence. However, now, please calm down. Next. Let the teacher introduce you. 
A brand new ruin. Ellipsis 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 dot dot. Global God Choice. Only I choose say in Bloodline 13. Chapter 13. Chapter 13. Dream Ruins. Brand New Ruins. Shu Heng is also very curious. As a freshman, so far, he has only been to one ruin, the former Dragon Ball. That is the place where the new students have their bloodlines, that is, the novice village. And this time, what the teacher introduced was the advanced relics. It is no longer a bloodline fit, but an ability improvement. Suddenly, a white light flashed, and at the podium, a huge display screen lit up. Everyone, please see. Ahead, the teacher's voice sounded. Xu Heng raised his head and looked intently. The first thing that appeared on the screen was a huge energy shield, in the shape of a bowl, buckled upside down on the ground. That size, Xu Heng reckons, could cover four of the gyms he's been to at once. Then, the line of sight zoomed into the energy shield. Different from the previous, Dragon Ball, Ruins. In the ruins this time, there is no test crystal ball and no central stone pillar. Instead, there are four huge clocks, facing south, east, north, and west in a circle, standing in the center of the ruins. Each clock is estimated to be the size of a teaching building. There is no smooth ground around the clock. It's rows and rows of seats, or recliners. The chairs are divided into four areas, each facing the four clocks. Ouch, what is this clock for without a crystal ball? And that recliner, for sleeping. So easy. Looking at the huge picture of the ruins on the screen, the students below burst into exclamations. The ruins this time are called, Dreamland. The clock in the middle, named, Hypnosis Clock. Just as everyone was fascinated, the teacher's explanation sounded. The ruins were discovered five years ago by our school's Piccolo de Malfit, Satu Nan, when he went out to explore, and found it in the fog of the abyss with a mysterious strongman. After five years of excavation and transformation, with the joint efforts of a large number of powerful people around the world, it has become what it is now. There is one entrance to the ruins in every major city in the world. The outer energy shield was added later to protect the ruins. The function of this relic is not to allow everyone to select characters for bloodline matching, nor to provide everyone with weapons or abilities. There is only one purpose, that is, to temper your mental power and willpower. Listening to the teacher's explanation, Xu Heng was a little surprised, as expected of the great devil, he was able to discover such a great ruin, although it was also due to mysterious people. But, even so, the big devil is not unworthy of the name, Xu Heng recalled the battle in the gym, it was indeed the opponent who was too perverted. After the ruins are opened, there will be corresponding dream builders to help you fall into your dreams. And some weapons will be provided, etc. You can choose by yourself at that time. It is recommended to choose the one with strong firepower or one that can escape, and try to delay the time as much as possible, teachers the voice of the explanation remains. Then you will fall into a deep sleep and enter your own dreams, which is why there are reclining chairs in the ruins. And in the dream, you will see endless beasts in the abyss. As soon as the words fell, the students who were listening to the explanation below burst out in surprise. Why, is the function of this relic just to give people nightmares? Facing the students' questions, the teacher smiled slightly. Of course not, this beast is used to exercise your will. On the podium, the teacher waved his hand, and the screen flashed, and five different pictures appeared. The five pictures are for five different venues. Ellipsis 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 dot dot. The first picture is an aerial view of a city. The second one is a hotel. The third picture is a hospital, located on the top of the snow mountain. The fourth one is another city, but this time the location is by the sea. In the distance on the sea, there are creatures like birds flying. Taking a closer look, it turned out to be one after another of beasts and monsters, densely packed and uncountable. The fifth, neither a hospital nor a hotel, but a blank, nothing. Ellipsis 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 dot dot. 
Looking at the screen on the screen, Xu Heng's pupil shrank slightly, isn't this, inception? That world has been transformed by the strong. Teacher, can you explain these pictures? Xu Heng asked to confirm his judgment. As if hearing his question, the teacher's explanation sounded again. To be precise, this is a dream relic, which is divided into five levels, corresponding to the five pictures above. The first time you enter, it is the first floor, and the location is randomly transmitted. If you want to enter the second floor, you need to find the corresponding dream builder on the first floor and build your dream again. The way of training is to fight beasts. Fuck, the students below exclaimed when they heard the teacher's words, Teacher, I haven't successfully matched any heroes, I'm just an ordinary person. Isn't fighting beasts courting death? I want to live a few more years. Quote. Hee hee, don't worry at all. The teacher comforted. In addition, as I said just now, the dream is divided into five layers. The beasts and monsters in it are stronger than the first layer, and the first layer is fiercer than the first layer. Although the beasts at the back are very powerful. However, the fierce beasts on the first floor are very weak, and they are completely designed for ordinary people. Everyone here should be able to handle them. And, if you can't beat it, you can still run. As long as you stay in the dream long enough, even if you don't kill a single beast, your willpower will also increase. All in all, with your willpower, the longer you hold on, the more beasts you kill, the greater your mental strength and willpower will grow. In a dream, it doesn't matter if you are really killed by a beast. In reality, you will wake up, but your spirit will be weak for a while. However, there is one thing that must be emphasized. Don't enter the fifth layer dream without authorization, and don't try to find the fifth dream builder. Hearing the teacher's words, Xu Heng looked at the fifth picture curiously, there was nothing there, it was blank, which was different from the five layer dream in the original book. Why, are the beasts there very powerful? The teacher shook his head and replied solemnly. I don't know, because none of the people who have entered the fifth layer dreamland can come back normally. Global God Choice Only I Choose Say in Bloodline 14 Chapter 14 Chapter 14 A Combination of Alien and Inception No one can come back normally. The teacher's words made the students below silent for a while. Xu Heng was thoughtful. He had watched Inception several times. Because it is too real, after entering, it is extremely difficult to distinguish between reality and dream, so you have to rely on totems to make judgments. From the first layer to the fourth layer, the totem effect is obvious. But the fifth layer is different, the subconscious edge, the deepest consciousness. Even if there is a totem, it is impossible to identify whether it is a reality or a dream. If you are not careful, you will be completely lost and lost, and you will never be able to get out. It is estimated that few people know this. The most important is, the fifth floor, if you die, will only sink deeper and deeper. Unlike the previous layers, death can escape. Okay, classmates, in the fifth layer dream, everyone who has entered will basically have various abnormalities. Either die or go mad, and some even become vegetative, paralyzed for life. So, the fifth floor is not something you should consider now. Next, the teacher will explain the difference between different dreams in detail. After entering the ruins, everyone will be more psychologically prepared. After speaking, on the monitor, the screen flashed again, and two pictures appeared in front of everyone. To be precise, it is a static image and a dynamic image. Fuck, this is really exciting. Is this a monster growing on its head? Looks disgusting. I'm going to throw up. On the monitor, as soon as the picture appeared, the quiet atmosphere in the class was instantly broken, and the students began to discuss enthusiastically. Many classmates complained one after another, couldn't stand it, and even wanted to vomit. And within the class, Xu Heng looked at the monster on the screen with a look of excitement. Because of that monster, he is very familiar. Isn't this an alien? This is obviously a face hug. On the seat, Xu Heng's hands trembled slightly. Although he tried his best to suppress his inner excitement, he couldn't help but let out two exclamations. In the past, he just liked watching all kinds of movies, and he had watched it many times, like Dragon Ball. And the beast that appeared this time was actually a movie he had seen before, called, Alien. He has completely watched all the films in the Alien series, and there are a total of 12 different forms of the aliens in it. And the picture the teacher put on this time is the cub inside the alien, which is still in the early stage of alien development, called the face-hugging body. 
Okay, everyone be quiet. Ha ha, it's good to see what you're used to. The teacher comforted everyone and continued to introduce. This thing, called the face-hugging body, is one of the beasts in the abyss. But it's still in the early stage, and it just ran out of the beast's egg. Of course, even in the early stages, it would be very troublesome if he was attached to his body. His tail will strangle your neck, and when you feel like you're suffocating and you open your breath, his tentacles shove hard into your throat. The second dynamic picture is the process of his attacking people. However, the following students obviously do not want to see it. Teacher, turn the page quickly, this looks so scary. Some female students felt like they were about to cry. Well, well, I'll go through it quickly. Seeing that the students reacted so strongly, the teacher did not insist. So I flipped through the photos on the screen and quickly passed the beasts on the second, third, and fourth floors, hoping to give everyone a general impression. Below, Xu Heng excitedly looked at the flipped pictures. Although the teacher turned quickly, he still recognized the beast behind him. Ellipsis 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 dot dot. The beast of the second layer of dreams is a messenger alien. The third layer is the late variant, the queen alien. On the fourth floor, there are no new aliens, but a big carnival of all aliens. Obviously, the fourth layer is very dangerous. It is still something in the alien movie, but it has developed into a mature body with more powerful offensive power. As for the fifth layer dream, the teacher didn't know what it was, so it was blank. After recognizing all the beasts, Xu Heng was very excited. It would be better to watch more movies. Dragon Ball, he saw, got Saiyan blood. Now in, alien, he also knows the plot. I just don't know the fifth floor of this dream relic. Suddenly, he had a flash of inspiration again. On the fifth floor, it doesn't matter if the totem is useless, but the Saiyan bloodline itself is a super big bug. When others die on the fifth floor, their consciousness will become weaker and weaker. But, Saiyan will get stronger and stronger. As long as the will is tempered to a certain extent, is it not easy to shatter the dream? Thinking of this, he could hardly contain his excitement. Hey, why are you shaking? You won't be frightened by this monster photo. Next to Xu Heng, Wu Dun slapped him. Seeing Xu Heng trembling slightly, Wu Dun was very puzzled. This guy is not really afraid, right? A few photos, what danger could it be? However, Xu Heng ignored Wu Dun and continued to recall the plot of Inception, thinking about how to freely enter and exit dreams. After quickly finishing the picture of the beast, the teacher continued to introduce. In addition to the endless beasts, there is another very important thing in the dream ruins. That is, the flow of time in the ruins is different from the real world. On the first floor of the ruins, ten minutes have passed inside, and only one minute has passed outside. The second floor is ten hours, and the outside world has only passed one minute. The third floor is ten days. On the fourth floor, a full month has passed inside, and only one minute has passed outside. The time flow rate is more than 40,000 times poor, and exercising in it will definitely get twice the result with half the effort. Hearing this, at the bottom, Xu Heng, who had been trembling slightly, couldn't hold back his excitement. Excitedly stood up and asked loudly, Teacher, when will this ruin be opened? Ellipsis 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 Global God Choice. Only I Choose Saiyan Bloodline 15. Chapter 15. Chapter 15. Crazy Training. In the classroom, Xu Heng excitedly stood up and asked the teacher questions. Because he really couldn't hold back his inner impulse. He could imagine that this dream relic would be of great help to him. He knew all the secrets of Inception, knew the way to freely enter and leave the dream, and also knew why the fifth floor was so terrifying. There is also the feature of slowing down the flow of time, which can double his cultivation time. The most important thing is that because he has Saiyan's bloodline, the more he faces the danger of dying, the more he can stimulate his powerful potential. That place is dangerous to others, but to him, it is an excellent exercise. Earth, comparable to a spiritual time house. In front, the teacher who was explaining, was slightly taken aback by Xu Heng's question. Looking at his excited eyes, he smiled. 
It seems that this classmate is not afraid at all, but a little impatient. Let me remind you first, everyone who enters the ruins will have a score. In the ruins, the longer you stay and the more beasts you kill, the higher your score will be. And the higher the score, the greater the potential, and the more the school will reward at that time. Those who score high enough will get a high cash reward from the school. What's more, you may get a relic entry card, and you can freely choose relics to explore. Speaking of this, a heartache appeared on the teacher's face, you must not think that the major ruins of the school can be entered and exited at will. Every time you enter the ruins, you need to spend a lot of money. Just because of your new status, you have the opportunity to experience it for free. You must cherish it. The teacher is now going in and out of the dream ruins, and the cost is as high as millions. Chu Hang, who was below, agreed with it. He wanted to enter the gravity training room before, but was scared off by the high cost. Ever since he knew that in the school, he had to collect money even to check the information, Xu Heng felt his poverty deeply. Too poor to use the free training room. He also hoped to get cash rewards from the school so that he can buy more cultivation resources. So far, all the information on the ruins has basically been introduced. And the ruins will officially open in two weeks. Today's class, this is the end, get out of class. After class, Xu Heng did not go back to the dormitory, but continued to the training room. He hopes to quickly improve his strength. It is best to have enough strength to fight against the alien queen before entering the ruins, so that he can travel unimpeded in the dream ruins, so as to carry out deeper training. Ellipsis 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 dot. At the door of the training room, seeing Xu Heng handing over his ID card, the janitor was stunned for a moment, then whispered, this guy again, come to train again. A freshman in the logistics department, taking advantage of his position. It's a bit too much. What? Xu Heng who came to the training room, warmed up slightly and started training directly after finishing the equipment work. 200 sit-ups, 150 pull-ups, 120 weight-bearing squats, bird rowing, standing bounces, and 40 kilometers jogging with weights. The same as the firm implementation of one item after another. Time flies by day by day, and in the blink of an eye, a week is gone. Now the speed of strength improvement seems to be slowing down, and it can even be said to be invalid. After another day of training, Xu Heng frowned slightly when he saw the physical parameters that had hardly increased on the attribute panel. When the protagonist pull-up increased to 500, 1000, and other regular training items, the training volume had doubled several times, he gradually felt that the training seemed to have reached a bottleneck. Saiyan's bloodline is invincible and there should be no bottleneck. So to be precise, it should be that the regular training program has failed, and it can no longer stimulate him. Like that jogging with weight, 40 kilometers, 50 kilometers, or even 100 kilometers makes no difference to him. He felt like he could keep running if he wanted to. Some unconventional programs are needed to stimulate the body more intensely. Only near death can you become stronger. So, starting from the eighth day, Xu Heng added two new items, standing and snorkeling. Saiyan's bloodline has endless potential. Every time he fights to a near-death state, and then recovers completely, Saiyan's combat power can increase by leaps and bounds. So if you want to use training to improve, you must feel that dying state. Ellipsis 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 ellipsis. In the swimming pool, a figure jumped into it. That was Xu Heng's breath holding training. From the eighth day on, he stopped regular training. Because, those regular strength training, for his current body, is like a tickling, no lethality. Now every morning, after Xu Heng wakes up, he will do stance training first. This is the training method of traditional martial arts. In addition to enhancing the strength of the body, it can also increase the control of the body, which is exactly what he needs now. After the stance training, it was the diving breath holding project that he had already prepared. Today was the 13th day and the last day before the ruins opened. Xu Heng has been training frantically for 13 days. Inside the pool, watch the increasing numbers on the timer. One minute, two minutes, five minutes, Xu Heng felt a sense of suffocation, he wanted to stick his head out and take a breath of fresh air on the water, but he didn't get up. 
10 minutes, 20 minutes, he felt dizzy for a while, his limbs became weak due to lack of oxygen, and he did not get up. One hour, two hours, Chu Heng's eyes darkened, he could no longer see the numbers on the timer, and he still didn't get up. I don't know how much time has passed. Just when Xu Heng felt that his consciousness began to blur, and the whole person seemed to be dying. He began to struggle violently, arching from the bottom like a worm to the shore step by step. Finally, his head stuck out of the water. Hiss. The air in the whole world seems to be sucked up by him. After an unknown amount of time, his consciousness, his sight, finally began to recover. Immediately, he looked at the timer, and after seeing the numbers, he was shocked, and his dizzy brain became awake. 